Park the cars close enough together that you'll be able to connect jumper cables to both cars' batteries. Notice again which terminal on each battery is positive and which is negative. Then attach the jumper cables to the appropriate places. The positive, red, cable should be attached to the positive terminals on each battery. The negative, black cable, should have one end attached to the negative terminal of the dead battery and one end grounded. Attach one red jumper cable clamp to the positive terminal on the dead battery. Attach the other end of the same cable, the second red jumper cable clamp, to the positive terminal on the working live car battery. Attach one black jumper cable clamp to the negative terminal of the working live car's battery. Attach the other end of that cable, the second black jumper cable clamp, to an unpainted piece of stationary metal on the car with the dead battery. Do not attach this clamp to the negative terminal on the dead car's battery. Next, start the car with the live battery. This will immediately start charging the dead battery. The car with the dead battery will be able to be started immediately. The last step is to disconnect the jumper cables. This should be performed in the reverse order that they were connected. Don't touch the cables to anything else until they've all been disconnected. Or you risk sending an electrical current somewhere you don't want.